Soda Popinski. All right, these next few donations are actually. No, I'm gonna shoot myself in the foot for doing this. Because now people are gonna start saying FJ and sending Billy a bunch of stuff. You already say that when you're out of the room. <laughs> you say it when I'm in the room. That's true. I have a um, a uh, anonymous donor, um, if you will. Well, anonymous to y'all who uh, finds me some games and some cool things of the like. Um, I've got NCAA Basketball, Super Nintendo, Super Mario World, Killer Instinct on Super Nintendo, a uh, Mad Cat's Genesis controller. You want to see that? Yeah, I have a Haunted Genesis, no controller, remember? The uh, That's right, I forgot. Okay, well, there you go. Now the doggo has a controller for his Haunted Genesis. The, uh, the purple... What, 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 what's the purple? Atomic purple? Is that right? Yeah, I think... Yeah, I was in a, like a... No, I thought, it, I thought the what Atomic was, was green. Was, I think ice... Was it... Or ice blue. blue. It's blue. blue. There's ice, ice blue. purple. It's the Atomic purple, right? Jungle green. I was right. Atomic purple N64 controller. That's awesome. Um, also, another video game here. Oh, look at that. Take that with you. Super Mario Kart. The best Mario Kart ever made. No, nah, Double Dash. Mm. Double Dash, I'm just saying. Mm. Oh, that was a 64 Mario Kart suck. Well, you know, along my, my anonymous donor, also, um, how can I play those games without a Super Nintendo? What do you think of that? No, sir. I don't like it. <laughs> Uh, let's see. We'll, we'll keep we'll keep with the 16-bit era. This is more for my anonymous donor. Yes, all this stuff goes in Jay's personal collection. Like I said, now now people are gonna be like, screw you. Jungle Book, Genesis, and Billy just anonymously donated some ass gas. Thank you, sir. Wheel of Fortune, Sega Genesis, Pac-Man 2, New Adventure, Sega Genesis. Risk, Sega Genesis, all these complete in box. Remember playing Risk on board games? Yeah, board kids? let's see that. Mm. The graphics are surprisingly impressive on this. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Um, got a Sega Genesis six pack. Also got Pokemon Snap on Nintendo 64. And a... Cleaning kit for a Nintendo Game Boy. Did you even know they made these? No. I'm... I actually did not either. I have never seen one of these before. Come on, alcohol. Open that up for me. I know, alcohol. Alcohol and Q-tips. Rubbing Tips 101. Q-tips and alcohol, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm. Your mother, Trebek. Well, I wanted you to open it. Uh oh. So. I guess I didn't hear that. Little Game Boy cleaning kit right there. I like. I like, I like. You want to do this third bag? Go ahead, you're good. I'm good, all right. Yeah, good. Some more for my anonymous donor. Some pretty good stuff in here, man. Um, Spec Ops, Airborne Command, PlayStation. Spec Ops Ranger Elite, PlayStation. Um, I actually just got these last week. Uh, Brunswick Pro Bowling, Garfield Lasagna Wool Tour, uh, Steel Factory Sealed. Those are gonna look good on the shelf. Not when I open them. <laughs> Not when you open them. I got um. Go look over in my the pocket of my jacket over there. That that black jacket thing. Got it? Yeah. Don't show them. Don't show them yet. Don't show them. Okay, no, you go ahead. You do these. All right. This is more for my anonymous donor. All right. 
More from the uh, unnamed anonymous donor that I won't name. <laughs> but I know who it is. We got a uh, Sonic Spinball from Game Gear. Uh, we got. I'll go ahead and open this up so they can see it a little bit better. Here, let me open the ones. Open the other ones up. All right, go ahead. Uh, we got Sonic. I see a theme going on with the Sonic games. We also got Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Good one. It really was. Actually, to be honest with you, all the Sonic games are good until they started getting into the 3D realm. Then they kind of uh, dropped the ball on that one. Uh, we got, uh, for also for Game Gear, Miss Pac-Man. Okay, I beat this game. It's pretty hard. Pretty difficult. Two-player mode co-op. Uh, Samurai Showdown as well. You know, generic Street Fighter, but still a good game. Still a good game. And one of my personal favorites of all time, uh, Chess Master. Because I am the Chess Master. You know I can beat you in chess, right? You know I can beat the Chess Master, right? I am the Chess Master, so no, no, you can't not. beat me. Yeah, you've never beat me, ever. I smell a new video. Me and Daryl, two out of three. Me and Dodongo, two out of three. I, chess? I guess so. We're playing prison rules. You lose, I shank you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll let the audience... You forget, that's what I learned to play. We'll let the audience decide Not in prison, but jail. Oh, uh, here, one more thing. Okay. And, of course, uh, what would all these great great titles be without something to play them on. We have the Sega Game Gear. Classic. It is classic, actually. What do you, what'd you like better, the Game Gear or the uh, Game Boy? I like the Game Boy for the battery life. Uh, you know, just because you really could play it longer, but the Game Gear, hands down, has better graphics. And those color. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's color. Dude, look, six batteries on the Game Gear. Game Boy only needed four. Yeah, and they, they didn't pull that crap that Nintendo did. We have Game Boy Color coming out, and it's just the Game Boy that's a different color is all. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> the hell of a marketing scheme. It's almost as good as Pokemon. It's got to catch them all. That's and you just keep adding Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Kids will never catch them all. The money maker right there. <laughs> oh, man. That's freaking awesome. Uh, this is, this, this haul right here is pretty, pretty good. I mean, don't get me wrong. Uh, everything that, that, that uh, we have gotten has been freaking amazing and awesome, especially since it's been freaking free. There's been some, uh, this little package here is, is, uh, pretty cool. This is from Comedy Room 10. Dear Jay, here's some free stuff. Thanks for the cool bids. Short, sweet, to the point. Thank you very much, Comedy Rule 10. I wonder if he is 10. His his handwriting kind of looks like a kid's. Look at Melbourne's handwriting. It's true. Worse than that. Maybe I'm an ass for ripping on someone to give me some free stuff, but my handwriting sucks, too. Don't worry about it. Comedy Room 10. Appreciate it. Uh... Some good stuff. You're the RPG guy. You want to start it off? Yeah, actually, this was this was a good one back in the day. I thought I, I remember it was. I don't know, we never had it, but a couple of my friends did. Wizardry. Um, well, we got five. Yeah, I had to make sure that wasn't a Roman numeral right there. <laughs> but yeah, Wizardry five is a pretty good one. I remember uh, the first Wizardries we had for the old uh, Tandy two thousand. What long time ago? We got. Uh, what is this? Wise Wanderers from Wise Three. Ease. Wise Three. Ease. Wanderers from Ease. Wanderer from Wise. I'm just saying. It's like like this guy. You, you can't. You don't. Per it's not Ninja Gaiden. It's Ninja it Gaiden. is Ninja Gaiden. It's, it's Ninja not, Gaiden. No, it's Ninja Gaiden. Yeah, the, the, the maker of the games even said it themselves. Well, they Ninja they Gaiden. Say it wrong. Because you're guiding a ninja through the city. Oh, here we go. Good that was their reasoning team. for it. That's all I'm saying. All right. It was a game oh, form. Okay. I'm not going to argue because I'm right. It was a game form. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It was on Wikipedia. <laughs> Google it. Google it. No, I'm not going to Google that. All right. Uh, I'm not too sure about this game, but it does look kind of like the uh, well, eyeball creatures from Doom. You got Eye of the Beholder. Well, you, know, you guys need to hurry up. Yeah. It's like 23 minutes so far. I was going to make two, two or three episodes out of it anyways. All right, well, you're out of battery, so you better yeah. hurry up. 
Captain yeah. America and the Avengers. Oops. How much battery life we got? Good like, jobs. like probably seconds. Get into the battery. Well, hurry up. Pac-Man, Sega Game Gear here. Got the Nest cleaning kit. Goes on. Pat upon two. Play, uh, PSP. Not, uh, uh, not that yet. We got a Return of the Jedi on the uh, 2600 here. Box Return of the Jedi. Uh, go ahead with that one. Okay. Uh, what is this? Uh, double Ender. We got an Artillery Duel and Chuck Norris. Chuck freaking Norris. Chuck Norris. Uh, this will be the first Super Famicom games in mine or Billy's library. And uh, yes, we're like kids. You have to get us the same one or we will fight to no end over who gets what. So this is uh, Hole in One Golf, Super Famicom. A couple of videos here, VHS tapes. Nice, and Captain Power, Future Force Training, Skill Level 1. And then we also have the only thing that Jamie Thomas will skate to, some Iron Maiden. Who did I say this stuff was from? I lied. This is from, this is from Sega WTTNL also. Uh, we got some autographed Star Trek. The new one was good. I'm sorry, but it was. Mad Max, some autographs here on that. Some little uh, Friday the 13th. Warrington G Gillette. So that's cool. And a little little Halo guy. That's pretty neat. So thank you very much, Sega WTTNL again. Appreciate it. <laughs> Oh, actually, the little Halo Man was from uh, Comedy Room 10. Little Halo Man, thank you for that, sir. Good stuff. Did you, did you see that zip code? No, what was it? 66601. <laughs> <laughs> Topeka, Topeka, Kansas. Kansas. 66601. It's gotta be shitty to live there. <laughs> <laughs>